Charles Christian Potter is an Australian Liberal Party politician and lawyer serving as Attorney General of Australia since 2017, and has served as Member of Parliament for Peers since 2013. He was appointed Minister for Industrial Relations and Leader of the House in 2019. From Perth, Potter attended Hale School, the University of Western Australia and later the London School of Economics and practiced law at Clayton Woods and taught law at the University of Western Australia before his election to Parliament. He is the son of the 1956 Olympic silver medalist, Charles Chilla Potter, and the grandson of Queensland Liberal politician, Charles Potter, who was a member of the Queensland Legislative Assembly from 1966 to 1980. Before his election to the Federal House of Representatives, Potter had served in the Parliament of Western Australia. He first entered the Legislative Assembly after winning the seat of Murdoch in a 2008 by-election. Following the death of the sitting member, Trevor Sprigg, and he was subsequently elected to the new seat of Bateman at the 2008 general election. After the Liberals formed government, Potter was appointed Attorney General in the Barnett Ministry. In December 2010, he was also appointed Treasurer and held both portfolios until June 2012, when he resigned from the ministry to contest the 2013 federal election. Before assuming his current position, Potter was parliamentary secretary to the prime minister in the Abbott government from December 2014 to September 2015, and then minister for social services in the Turnbull government from September 2015 to December 2017. In March 2021 a historical rape allegation against Potter became public. Potter's father was Charles Chilla Potter, who won a silver medal at the 1956 Summer Olympics and was director of Western Australia's Liberal Party during the 1970s and 1980s. Chilla's father, Charles Robert Potter, was a Queensland Liberal state MP between 1966 and 1980 and served in the Ministry of Joe BLK Peterson. Potter was educated at Hale School and was selected for Australia's National Schools debating team. From 1988 he attended the University of Western Australia where he graduated Bachelor of Economics and Bachelor of Arts with First Class Honours in Politics. Before completing a Bachelor of Laws degree, Potter later studied at the London School of Economics for a Master of Science in Political Theory, from which he graduated with distinction at the top of his class. Prior to entering Parliament, Potter worked predominantly as a lawyer, starting as a commercial litigator at Clayton Woods before moving to public practice. He spent a year as an advisor to the Federal Minister for Justice and then began working for the Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions as a senior state prosecutor. Before his election in 2008, Potter was working as a lecturer at Curtin University and the University of Western Australia as well as retaining part-time, his position as senior prosecutor at the DPP. At the 2008 election, Potter contested and won the newly created seat of Bateman following the abolition of the seat of Murdoch in the 2007 redistribution. He was appointed Attorney General and Minister for Corrective Services after the election, having held the equivalent shadow portfolios prior to the election. On 14 December 2010, Potter was sworn in as Treasurer of Western Australia. He retained the portfolio of Attorney General, while the Corrective Services portfolio was transferred to Terry Redman. On 12 June 2012, he announced he was stepping down from his ministerial portfolios to contest the seat of Pierce at the 2013 Australian federal election. At the 2013 election, Potter was elected to federal parliament with an 8% margin. He became Parliamentary Secretary to the Prime Minister on 23 December 2014 and held that position. Until 21 September 2015, he was a part of the Speaker's Panel from 18 November 2013 to 9 February 2015. On 20 September 2015, Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull announced that Potter would replace Scott Morrison as Social Services Minister as part of a Cabinet overhaul. In 2016, Centrelink, operating under Potter's senior oversight as Social Services Minister, became involved in a debt recovery controversy. 
despite heightened media interest and complaints. After meeting with the Department of Human Services, Porter stated that the program was working incredibly well. The program was later subject to a Senate committee inquiry, and the program was estimated to be responsible for over 2,000 deaths. In May 2020, Porter conceded that the robo-debt scheme had no legal basis and was unlawful, but refused to apologize for it. One of Porter's roles was to manage the cashless welfare card and increased its use in various communities. He spoke of his pride in the outcomes of the policy. However, the card has been linked to increased hardship for many of its users and its efficacy has been heavily disputed. During his